feel about our chances of making the playoffs. We're trying to build those habits, and that's kind of my approach out here tonight. I just want to come out here and have the playoff, playoff mentality, playoff approach, how we need to uh, approach, you know, in, in playoff situations, coach, you know, in, in after playoff games. Sometimes you have field sessions right after playoff games, win or loss, um, to adjust or critique or fix up something that's valuable or very important. So, um, that's what it is. It's just we're, we're still developing and uh, learning it. This is no other. So, uh, as you talk about uh, a playoff approach, a playoff mentality, mm -hmm. uh, I, for me, I feel like more so than saying it, but for sure. Okay. You know, that's just kind of my approach. And then it's easy to say, okay, this is what I'm talking about. You can show it. And, uh, you know, I think guys really responded. Guys really stayed in the fight. Very experienced team over there. Right. And, you know, for us to, to, to be in the battle and give ourselves a chance to win, regardless of being up 14, being down, whatever, getting back in the game, having a chance to tie the game and get the overtime. That's what it's about. And that's what we're going to see in the future. So, you know, developing now is important. Very much. Thanks. Despite not hearing what he said, uh, were you surprised that you were technical in that situation? I mean, if you say something to the coach, you know, <laughs> what do you think? You know, so, I mean, it, I'm sure you're looking at it as an uh, unfortunate situation because he, he got the technical earlier. You know, but um, the referee was standing there. I didn't hear him, but the referee was standing there. So, obviously, it's their, it's their decision to make uh, the, the call. But, you know, like I said, I. You know, that when you're uh, when you're on this other side and you're yelling at your coach, of course you want them to call it that. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? So, mm -hmm. I, I, like I said, I don't know what was said, and I don't know if it warranted, but I'm directed at the coach referee sitting there. You know, we have to take advantage of it. Thanks, Vince. Appreciate your mm -hmm. performance straight off the All Star break. Um, I mean, for me, I just wanted to come out with a lot of energy and effort. Um, we knew what, what position they're in. Um, we know they're trying to trying to maintain what they have going. We know they're trying to get into the playoffs. So they, for me, I knew they were going to throw a lot of energy, so I tried to match it in my team. I tried to match it. We did a great job. Um, I just couldn't make enough plays on the stretch, and I, uh, it's tough. So like 30 points tonight, 10 assists. Almost a, a magnificent shot deep from deep to, to win the game. Can you talk to us about the final seconds down the stretch? Uh, for me, I, I, I had some, some good looks. Um, I thought, thought a few of my shots were going in, but uh, I, didn't, I didn't do enough to help my team tonight, even though I up a, a little bit of points and got some, got some downs, but I didn't, didn't do enough. You guys are right back in action tomorrow night, of course, back to back. Phoenix will be in town. They have a pretty good, good group of guards over there. Yeah. What are you looking forward to, and how are you looking to bounce back in tomorrow night's game? Just looking forward to come back uh, tomorrow and, and try to get a win. Uh, just, they're they're, they're uh, having a, an up and down season. Uh, they they win a few games, and then right now they're on a, a streak of, of losing. So we know they're going to come in with a lot of effort and energy. And, for us coming off the back-to-back, -back, we need to come back with the same same mentality of uh, coming in, trying to win, and uh, trying to play hard. So it, was, it was a little bit chippy out there on both sides, especially in the second half. Just normal competitive stuff or a lot of talking more, more, more than normal? Right? Yeah, I love it. I love it. I love it when you get in that competitive zone. We were talking back and forth. That's, that's, that's the part of the game. It's competitive nature. Uh, I mean, I love it. I love that type of type of game. And people are talking back and forth. It's, it's miss a game that much more fun. You obviously got the um, the Oklahoma connection with Blake. Mm -hmm. Do you guys share any kind of um, words see, or anything see. like that? Is there going to be any kind of you know, brain rights or just anything that you're going to talk to him about specifically looking forward to or anything? Uh, for us, we, we were talking back and forth and uh, out there on the court. We just, it's, it's competitive. Um, we both want to win. Uh, we know it's a little bit of bragging right back home. Uh, we, we don't really focus on that. We focus on, on the game. Uh, there's always going to be competitive talk. And, but I mean, he's a good dude off the court. But we're definitely trying, trying to get our win for a team. Uh, coming into the game, what was probably like your biggest point of emphasis? Something that you want to make sure coming back with you? Uh, personally, personally, yeah. Uh, thinking, well, personally, and as a team, we you know we just want to get our rhythm back. You know, taking a taking a break like we are or have done. You know, we always lose a little bit of a step. Um, but I think you know we did a good job coming out and competing tonight anyway. Uh, 
we just got to do a better job of finishing, you know, the story of our season. Uh, coming down the stretch, we got to make close plays and finish games. What about you specifically, though? Just, just yeah, uh, I think it was the same thing, you know, uh, definitely trying to balance, you know, getting some rest, trying to get my body right back right for, you know, the back to back, after, you know, a nice busy weekend. So uh, I think I've done a good job of that and uh, we're just going to continue to recover and get ready for tomorrow's game. What was the play or the plays that sort of elevated the chippiness of the game? <laughs> I think it was just, you know, a chippy game back and forth from the last time we played them. You know, I think the referees made a couple of calls, which kind of, you know, enhanced the, you know, intensity, whether, you know, the call will be right or not. I think, you know, guys are getting, you know, uh, anxious and, bit you know, for the game. But uh, I think it was just, entire you know, the, throughout the entire of the game, it was just very chippy and it got down to the wire. So, you know, you, you're going to see that competitive nature come out. Thank you guys. Thank you. Appreciate you.